my name's Justin. Uh, I'm a part of the uh, Violence, Abuse and Mental Health League. I'm Sean Oram, and I'm the Director of the Violence, Abuse and Mental Health Network. Yeah, so, I mean, from my, from, from my experience, well, from my admitted experience, I guess, we're, we're heading that way where we're valuing the voice of, the, of, of experts by experience or lived experience. We're actually valuing that properly and, and rewarding it in a way that, um, I think, Shan, this kind of goes back to where the conversation we've been having lately are around the financial remuneration, but that isn't just about finances, it's about value um, and values and sort of valuing that voice equally to that of the academic or that of the, the um, professional, if you will, within the space, so that it becomes more of an equal platform and that you can then start to um, explore and, and not just me but for others and then encourage others into that, that kind of fold if you will and, and the way that people are treated then equally offers the opportunity for more people to get involved and feel comfortable enough to step forward and, and share their experience because it's different from mine and as everyone else is different from each other's if you will and it's just nice to get that collective voice of, um, of value or through values that kind of everyone shares really. One of the earliest pieces of work we did in the network was um, a, a, a consultation in collaboration with McPin Foundation of people with lived experience of violence, abuse and mental health problems to identify what, what research priorities would be in this space. And that's been a really helpful um, activity for us to have done because it's really informed um, the grant competitions that we've run, so the, the, the research that we've looked to fund through the network, but it's also helped us think about what events that, you know, what events we're running and what research do we want to highlight that we know is of interest to survivors. So really trying to get the, the, the voice and priorities of, of survivors throughout um, the network has been really important to us.